Sometimes you can find sisterhood in the least likely places, like on the ground after being tackled. The UNC women's rugby club team tells us it isn't the hard hits that makes them a good team, but the bonds they formed while making them. Rosita Cox has the story. When you think of love and compassion, this is not what usually comes to mind. But for the Tar Heels, this is exactly how they show love. I don't think that I would have ever met any of these people if it wasn't for rugby. UNC's women's club rugby team, one of the best in the South. And what makes this team so strong? It's this kind of close bond that happens when you're literally like sacrificing your bodies on the field. That bond has taken the team to the Sweet 16 for the past five years. And last year, they beat Harvard in the Elite Eight. The Carolina women's rugby program has had a really long history uh, in terms of women's programs. It was started in 92, and since then it's been kind of a regional powerhouse for women's rugby. And coming from the South, that is unusual. Tapper says their success does not come from individual raw talent. In rugby, your success really depends on your teammates, and I like that. Teammates who aren't afraid to take a hit for each other if they have to. And they say that is what they love most about the game. In Chapel Hill, I'm Rosita Cox reporting.